I open the stream. Welcome to the Welcome to this. Tim's playing a game that y'all can't see. No, I I just have to merge these mansions really quick. And He's playing a game called Merge Mansion. Is that We've sold out! You, you know, you know, sometimes when we're streaming, I think to myself, I'd like to be playing a game right now on my phone. <laughs> this uh we have been sponsored by NordVPN. <laughs> And Clash of... No, what do they do? What's the big uh, uh, stupid mobile game that everybody plays? Supercell? No, not Supercell. Crash Royale? Not Crash Royale. Uh, I don't know. It's really bad. Anyway, please spend lots of money on microtransactions. I mean, here's the thing, though. How dumb are we for not having people do microtransactions at us. Well, if we were became uh <laughs> well, affiliates, be <laughs> if we became affiliates, we they could do that. They yeah. give us bits. Yes. We just need a micro trans transact. Oh yeah, I should tell the server that we're live. Continue. Cram. Cram? So we're still still trying to find out who murdered Sonic. Our friend Sonic the Hedgehog. What are, do I just I just click on things? Huh? Sanic, Sanic the Sanic. God, this game. So hang in there. Stream, let's go. Hang Red thirteen. There, do we sound okay? Do we sound cool? A child hangs precariously from a. Chair. Sounding cool and the audio being fine. Large text below reads, "Hang in there." Oh, you have no idea, Red thirteen. I feel the same way doing this stream. Refusing to use his wings to fly to safety. These past couple weeks have been nothing but hell. Oh, library car, saloon car. Where are the beautiful... <sighs> no camera? Library you, car. Is it just color bars right now? Where are the beautiful faces? <laughs> because it means that that didn't It's always camera. something. Because I didn't do the camera. It's a black square. A black square. <laughs> Shadow's lock was added to our inventory. That seems like a clue. Cluedo. That arm is really struggling to clean up this car. Okay, so I'm gonna try to fix this in real just time. Me, is the, did you flip the the look at me switch? I did. It shouldn't be black though. <gasps> Chaos Cola, Chaos Cola. <laughs> Do I have all the Chaos Emeralds? The love of our marvelous planet. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I, I I'm not reading all this. I'm just. This group knows everyone, and they've been everywhere, haven't they? Oh my gosh, I'm so I'm so nervous to be with this group. Cram, trash. No, there, there's nothing in the trash cans. Cram, cram. The trash cans are always empty. What? Did your camera break? Uh, he's he like opened some curtains back behind the TV, and now he's fiddling with wires. Maybe I'll rest my eyes a little bit. Cram's good. It's hot back there. Has Hansel. So hot right now. The capture card's hot, he says. That seems, that seems bad. Oh no, Cram, don't go to sleep. There's been a murder. All right. Um, oh, I just, something just happened. Something popped up. Sync your weather, news, and interests. No thanks. I bump a Windows key? Who knows? Alright. Uh, we're gonna talk to this poet. I should be able fancy a poem? Oh, I can't say no. Alright, we're gonna get a poem about space! Matt thinks his capture card broke. Oh, this is the good stuff. This is the good stuff. He, he's running around. He's running around the basement. He says he has a backup. We got a backup, people. I think he's going to hot swap it. He hasn't thought it through, has he? Ooh, I can talk? No, never mind. Start interrogation. Have I... What'll it be? Oh, it's a poem. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Uh, it's a poem about trains. 
Can I take your order? Uh, a poem about my starved stomach, babbled tummy, scrambled eggs, sunny. We don't serve eggs. Get out of here, SBO. We don't serve eggs on this train. All right, did I talk to everybody? I think we talked to that alligator man. Did you bring me any meat to chop? I may be a butcher. Man of authenticity. He tried to bring a knife on the train. This man with the blood-stained shirt is so suspicious. All right, I'm going to start it. Well, okay, what? Okay. Where's my inventory? Here it is, here it is, here it is. Is this it? Ugh, okay. Stop. Okay. I've got a train map. I've got a menu. And I've got Shadow's Lock. There's got to be more to it. Oh, 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 right here. Ooh, brochures. Travel distance. Oh. Cram, look at this. There's a couple maps. A map of the library car. The books are organized by genre. I love a good overhead map. Overhead map. Uh, yeah, I don't know what anyone was saying. I couldn't see the chat, anybody. Library map. You know, it's too late. Nobody shares my fondness for caves. Now we're back. All right, we're going to look at this overhead library. So I'll tell you what happened. This isn't a good... Look at this. Ah! I think you're gesturing. That's yeah, why it's I coming am. in. Well, you should turn that off. I would love to. <laughs> End of statement. Rear. <laughs> um, so what had happened was, um, <laughs> so what happened was, this is this is something I'm still going through, uh, in terms of like recovery from it. I'm pissed <gasps> off. So, um, I bought a power supply to replace the one in there off eBay. It turns out that power supply is fucking broken, and it fried uh, some shit in the computer. Luckily, it doesn't seem like it, there's anything too bad. However, that's the one casualty from this computer so far is the um, the capture card. So that thing's fucking dead. So I, I had another identical one, so I got to buy another one. And thankfully, we're back. And VMix lets us do that without shutting down the whole fucking program. Thanks, VMix. Uh, however, my retro computer, which I did put it in, absolutely fried and will not turn on and had smoke. So um, fuck off that... Uh, it's so hard to get parts that are retro. Like, they don't make them anymore. And so the fact that it's fucking broken, just the cherry on the shit sandwich that these two weeks have been. You don't usually put cherries on those. Yeah, I know. Yep, this is Dr. Eggman's autobiography and recipe book. <laughs> yes, huh? So, I you probably... Uh, <laughs> It's Dr. Robotnik's recipe book. Oh, yeah. Toku's okay, but yeah, it's kind of delayed. I have it on my little Roku's as well. Um, hopefully, that's the only thing that got fried in this computer. Uh, everything else seems to be okay. Knock on wood. Um, that little capture card is only about $20 on Alibaba, so it's not really that uh, that big of a, a tragedy. <laughs> I did have to order a whole new board, motherboard for my retro computer from uh, the Ukraine. Oh, my God. And hopefully um, that's the only thing I fried was the motherboard and not any of the very hard to find parts that were inside it. We're going to interrogate this man. Um, I guess the, the moral of the story, and I, I wish every other thing I say go for, like buy used parts on eBay, don't buy a used power supply. I should have known better. This is my fault. Not enough evidence. Just buy new power supplies. What the freak else am I going to look for? I'm looking all around the place. Look at harder. What? I already did that. Can you, like, there's that arrow over to the corner? Ah, uh, thank you. Yes, that's it. <laughs> so that was missing. That's why this is a two player game. Yes, little brother mode. Sonic needs me! Alright, let's move on. I I'm mean, <laughs> we're just zooming. <laughs> uh, it's too much. <laughs> that's odd. I know some books have fallen out on the floor and everything, but every book on the shelves is now been a floor with this God. one! No. <laughs> it's the user guide to the Mirage Express. So, um, I have a new dog. That is the news news. Um, I have a new dog. However, the way he had came into this 
this household has been uh, chaotic, let's say. Chowdick. Ch- Chowdick. Oh my god. Good. <laughs> Just the way I'm moving my finger on this mouse. Trackpad. <laughs> oh my god. Just constantly opening up all your Windows secrets. Oh, I can't look at the book. All right. I didn't even know about that stupid bar, but um, now I do. Now you do. Interrogation! So, when we got the dog home, it was like 9.30 at night, and um, I, I'll talk about that too. Got a new tattoo um, as of like an hour ago. Uh, it's very sore, and I'm bleeding. Um, so, got him home, took him outside, and when we were taking him in from the backyard, he slipped his collar, something he shouldn't have been able to do, because um, he was wearing a special no-slip collar and ran away uh, very quickly, away from us, immediately. With, uh, and couldn't catch him, and I was freaking the fuck out. Um, I, don't, I don't mean to like get into every gory detail here, but uh, ran away, it was like 11 o'clock. Um, I put a message out to, well, him and, and the group text, and then I was trying to figure out what to do, because I was like, I had no idea what to do. Oh, oh yeah, your arrow keys. Oh, uh, space is jam. Thank you. No. And uh, so, yeah, it was intense. I was freaking out. This little dog that we just brought home, he's already had a terrible life. Um, he oh was God. scared of all humans, so there's no way he's coming back. Um, it was late. Uh, Red 13 um, actually came and helped and actually located him a little bit <laughs> later that it. night, but he's just too skittish. Um, I spent the next day basically not sleeping, contacting every agency and and contact every Facebook group and putting up posters. And uh, he's not here, of course. He's not here because he's moving. Uh, 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 what's his name on here? Tyrant Heel helped me put up posters. Um, and... Just trying to blanket the news, it, making sure like anybody who call me, I was contacting with the rescue, and they were very helpful. I contacted uh, trappers because we were gonna have to trap him, just barely. Just barely. Um, and so I didn't, I don't know how to trap animals or track animals, so had to figure out like how to do that. Turns out like trying to find a place that they stay and that they're they feel safe is like good. So we actually did end up finding that. It was in somebody who's really cool and knew some like people that we knew uh, in their yard, like under a bush. So it was like a matter of like telling everyone, if you see him, just let us know. Don't approach him. And then like keep putting stinky meats that he would like under the bush. The stinkier, the better. God, the smell is still in my nose. Um, notice he kept coming back to it. We, I talked to someone in the area who had a trap. Tim let me borrow his car so I could put the trap in the car. He also helped me pick up the trap. And it was just a matter of like a lot of luck that went into like, it was very lucky we found the place. It was very lucky that the person was cool. It was very lucky that nobody scared him away. It was very lucky that we found the trappers that we had. It was very lucky that he finally went in the trap. Um, I, I went to Attica to buy a trail cam, like a cellular trail cam that like motion detecting. So it'll like take a picture when it test like uh, senses motion and upload it on the cell phone. Uh, we got like a I got a notification at like 9:30, and he was in there. But then the next picture, it didn't look like he was in there. So it was like fuck, the trap not work. And then when we went in there, he was there, outpouring of an emotion. Took him home. And he's been under some strict lock and key. And like I said, he's a rescue. He's doing great. He's doing so much better even after a week. Um, I pretty much didn't sleep for two days straight. Um, and I was just Thanks. frenzied. And I did go to work one of those days too. So I'm sure I was putting out some quality stuff. Uh, so yeah, that was the story of Dog. Now we have one. His name's Barney. The he's, story of Dog. He's awesome. Um, He's doing, like I said, super great. Uh, he'll probably be on stream sometime. He's just not really allowed in the basement yet because he's he's getting better at not peeing in the house, but he's he's not had like a like a full couple days where he hasn't done that. He's getting better. Oh yeah, you're just so well. Such good thinking. There's a gamer moment. That was a gamer. A little bit of a gamer. Capital moment. G gamer moment. Yeah. 
Um, <clears throat> Tim's having gamer moments. I'm having dog moments. Thank you, Veracity Jane. And thank you, everybody who is here and everybody in town, whoever might be watching, for sharing and keeping me in the loop and helping out with anything that, it, like, it really did help. It was, there's no way that I would have been able to do this. It was like everybody who was involved and helped. There's just absolutely no, I had no clue to where to start of doing that. Um, so it was like everybody who helped involved in, in yeah. Uh, there was like a phrase that was going around in my head because the trainer, uh, or sorry, the rescue that we got him from, like when I had to do interviews for him because they're very thorough, Tim also helped with the interview. <laughs> he was one of the um, contacts there. Uh, they said like, he's very nervous. If he gets out, he's gone forever. And so I was just thinking about that the whole fucking time. Cram! Um, so yeah, like just good, happy ending. He has multiple, he has a, when we, we just took him on a walk today for like the first time, he's got a harness and a collar. By the way, the collar was not put on properly. That's why he slipped out of it. Shouldn't have, wasn't tight enough. I didn't put the collar on. Uh, we got him that way. Kind of sucks. Gosh. But I think again. Not, not blaming anybody. Like I said, the foster home he was in. He actually had a foster home, so it was better than him being killed and they, and they cared about him, so uh, no fault. Uh, just, just. Yes, so I actually bought one Red 13. I was looking at Fi. Um, we ended up going with Whistle, because uh, Fi collar, like it's a whole other collar. You can't just get it as a little module. Um, I have not set up the Whistle thing yet. I just got it today. But I was told that, like, definitely get a GPS collar. Um, and I actually, they told us that Fi was the one to go with instead of Whistle. But I just didn't like the, the having to put another collar on, because we're keeping the Martin Gale collar on. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just happy he's going to have something where we can track him. Whoever ends up getting out again, which, uh, if it's up to me, he will never have that happen. Thing two, I got a tattoo today. You can see it on Instagram. Um, I got it at six o'clock today and it, it's on my chest and it hurts a lot, but I was very brave um, through the whole thing. I didn't cry. And now it's bleeding and it's sore, but it's very, I'm very happy to have it now. I've been meaning to get this thing for a long time. Um, so that's a good closing of the week out, getting things, you know, back to normal next week i have my test for my ham radio amateur license so i can talk to all the old 70 year olds after i pass that i got to study for that stuff but if i pass that then uh... oh i'm mobile baby cb radio catch me i'll have a call sign and that's my weeks tim how about you <laughs> um uh nothing nothing so so eventful just a normal week yeah I'd like that I'm looking forward to it you put me on the spot how about you Tim well you, I was you, just why I you tell a story I feel like I've been talking at just for a while I didn't want to like monopolize the whole show all right I'm just clicking away <laughs> Mama, talk about a warm welcome. <laughs> My wife. <laughs> uh, Blaze. Hunting for a treasure. Uh, treasure. Treasure. Cram, you fool. You fool. Uh, Red 13, I uh, I might need to get that capture card back from you. A Fabergé. Because apparently the one of mine is dead. <laughs> So, I just have the one backup and I need the other one for the, the dual camera setup I'm going for. Uh, I don't need it right away. I just, I will need it back oh eventually. Oh, a blueprint. In the I was not anticipating card. one getting out. With the same blown code. away. 230402. Also, um, who's excited for New Zelda? I'm. Hyper excited for New Zelda. 
I have it on its way here now. I am... Oh, it's... Uh, I don't need it that soon. I just say I'm like, eventually. But I'm good with it. Like, um... I was... I'm thinking about streaming it. I don't know if I want to stream that game. Because what game? What game? the new Zelda game, Tears of the Kingdom. Um, you can't even say you can't play it now because uh, you got a Switch. You got a Switch. Yeah, but it's super expensive. It is. It's actually like more expensive than any Switch game so far. It's seventy bucks. That's too much. I bought it. I got it for sixty, which is why I don't have it too right now. Too much. Yeah. Um, but it won't always be. Um, the only reason I don't want to stream it is not because I, I don't like streaming. It's like I had so much fun with the first like Breath of the Wild game, and it was like such a good like just explore, feel immersed. I don't know if I can feel that when I'm streaming, so I, I might just have that as a as a meme. But I am just ecstatically uh, excited about this. I am, however, probably going to stream some fighting games because I have a tournament in two weeks, and I need to start practicing more, and I haven't because of circumstances. And so that'll be a good like uh, way for me to. I'm, I'm competing in three games, I'm not anticipating winning anything, just so I don't get completely humiliated. So I might do some like long streams, long fighting game streams, like maybe like four hours a piece. Between bouts of studying and taking care of the dog. Have the tail. Just disable them tails. <laughs> Cry and hope they sympathize. How are you all doing in the chat? How has your week's been going? Tell us all about it. You excited about the weekend? You got something fun coming up? I see this plan get executed. Oh, it just worked. You're just in the bank. The bank vault. <laughs> uh, on the train. The train bank vault. Fabergé. Again, is it? I, I always said chow, but is it like ca cow, like chaos, or is it chow? I know. Cow egg. Woo! The old prospector. <laughs> Two, three, zero, four. Oh, oh, oh there it is. The farmer's egg. Oh, all right. Let's get out of here. Hold on, kiddo. No further secrets whatsoever. Oh, I forgot. You can join the Discord and also call us at 765-213-PLAY. We're yes. still accepting phone calls. We'd love to talk to you. Anyone who's opened one of these has never lived to tell the tale. You can open the egg? You sure can. Twist it. Pull it. Bop it. Oh, uh, is it a bomb? Tick, 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 tick. Uh-oh. Each egg is a bomb. Boom, boom, ba -dum, boom, 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 Bombs always <laughs> tick. I think it's very funny that there is not one. Ah! Ah! What? Some days you just can't get rid of a bomb. Obviously, you throw it and lock it in the safe. Yeah, that's a good idea. Take one for the team. Oh. <laughs> Eat the egg. Can I see that? Yeah. There's open up and see if the wire's to cut. I'm like, do I, do I tell pick the a, egg to stop? Do I pick a funny one, or do I pick the one I think it, that's true? Good. Let tails cool it down with his tail. Not without any salt, I won't. Chaos control. The egg boy. Chaos control. All right, we're going to toss it in the safe. Close the door and twist the dial. There must be a weird way to relock it. Oh, it's not working. Uh, tell the tell eggs to stop. To stop. 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 <laughs> that did nothing. Let Tails cool it down with his tails. <laughs> Let it finish ticking and see what happens. <laughs> Worth a try. 
All right, kiss it, Rogue. Oh. That didn't work. What, what a prude. Set on fire, Blaze. Cram. You don't just say things, don't you? Cram. Smash the egg against the wall. What do you mean by this? This isn't a movie, Cram. <laughs> ah, heck. He's <laughs> Ah, chocolate, God. chocolate, chocolate. Rock the egg to sleep. <laughs> Just crank out and it's a nap. What did you hear about chaos control? Wow, dang it. No, Cram! Let me die! I want to die! That's what they want. Who are we to... The microwave kid. Stomp on it? I'm picking all... I yeah. Mean, we obviously have to just let it finish ticking. Okay. What if it's not a bum? What it's if confetti. it's an egg? What? Why would you make that assumption? <laughs> What are you saying? The, the, it's the what? hand, the robotic arms. The tech weapons are explosive. Okay. So they would have detected it as an explosive? I guess. How long do we have to wait? Is it just a timer? Like an egg timer? Is it like a confetti? It's not a bomb at all! Bomb it all! Ah, bomb it all. Phew! <laughs> My hunch was right, thankfully. Eee! Oh, oh it's, a, it's a cow. <laughs> it's a cow. It's an emerald cow. <laughs> Covered in chow. Covered in chow. <laughs> chow. It's a chow. It's a chow. Can you hand us the chow emeralds? Oh, uh, you have to collect all the chow emeralds. <laughs> I wonder why if the egg wasn't a bomb. Because they weren't as tough as us. I don't know. Who cares? It's a chameleon. Chameleon. Maybe they just naturally died of old age. What are names? This is for the chat. What are nicknames you have for your pets if you have a pet? Spill them. I want to hear them. What's up, Baffle Jacks? Baffle Jacks? Uh, yeah, we're definitely furries. That's what we are. That's what we're known for. I don't know if we are. Not that there's any shade there. Uh, I do think that we have had quite a few furry adjacent folks come into the chat. Uh, due to this game. Babble Jacks is a friend of mine. We went to almost all schools together. We were in school together since kindergarten. Um, and then we went to a different a different college. And Babble Jacks is also a new father again. Very cute kid. Hmm? It was a lot of fun. That's Dr. Eggman's logo. Every poker chip has seen his Eggman's mug on. Yeah, so we are... The question I asked the chat, Babblejacks, as you entered is, if you have pets, what are some ridiculous nicknames that you say to your pets? I just got a new dog, so I have been coming up with quite a few. I just want to know the pantheon of these interesting names give them the real name and like some nicknames that you give and apply to it because i think it's so funny yeah let's play slots big money big money play slots big money big money i lost try again yeah play slots big money big money try again yeah <laughs> play again what? you got a gambling problem no play <laughs> Play again! It's not a problem if I keep winning all the time. Again! 
Oh, is that Bruiser? Bruiser, 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 Bruiser Buns, Boozer, awesome. Denny, Dens, Dennis. Yeah. I like Denjamin. Dennis the Menace. Denjamin's <laughs> good. Alfred Lord Dennison. <laughs> Denny is a really cute one-armed cat that Tim got. He's a recently. three. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Lost one arm. Has three legs. <laughs> Missing one. He doesn't. He's not little. He's not little brother. He's not like <laughs> moving himself along. <laughs> I can make it on my own. Big money, big money. Try again. Play the slots. So All far, right. um, for ours, his name is Barney. Um, call him Barnopolis, Barn Door, the Barnacle. <laughs> um, he's also like. Extremely dense for his size. He's like a mini Australian Shepherd. He's really small, so I've been calling him Lashonk. 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 Whenever I have to pick him up, he is Lashonk. Well, once Amy Perry Blaze and I have immediately roped her in on the family tree. Chow, egg. Chow, cow. Chow, cow. Sonic? No. We're not even to the point where any of these people are fucking. Is that going to happen? Come on. Come on. There should at least be a little. Come I love on. that that little cane. The cow has a mustache uh -huh. and some shades. He's a security guard. <laughs> I got to stop this shirt from <laughs> sticking to my tattoo. It hurts so bad. Tattoo. Do, 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 Cash out voucher. F F 14,000 14, credits? That's enormous. That's big money. Uh, if you want to talk to us, 765 play is the number. She must have gone up We will Benar answer. We will talk. Me. You can also join our Discord and join the voice channel. And you can chat with us too and be on stream. Uh, it must be 18 or older to apply. That has been a problem in the past, and we have had to kick people. So please be older than 18. That's the only yeah. way. You have to be consenting. Can't have kids. It's just a whole problem. Jackpot. We'd love to have you in the chat. Ooh, Can't be in the oh, chat. There's, look, there's more. Ooh, knights. They made a knights reference. We can change them. No cheating. Uh, you dirty cheat. No oh, cheating. Excuse me. I'm so sorry. Yeah, wow. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm drinking this adult over 18 beverage. <gasps> over 18? Yeah. You just have to be 18 to drink that? Yes. What kind of a beverage is it? It's an alcoholic beverage. Appreciate the over 21 for those. Yeah, in America. God. That's <laughs> where we are. Yeah, we are. <laughs> or if you have really cool parents. Oh, it's Shadow. Is he wearing a Starbucks outfit? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Hey, what's going on? Oh, I love tails. that all of Shadow is like, what if we gave Sonic a gun? <laughs> what if he was cool and he had a gun? Oh, edgy. What if you had a cool gun? Microwave chili dog. What if you didn't like chili dogs? What if you liked guns? <laughs> um, I would <laughs> because I was coming home. Um, they did sanitize it. They did wipe it down, but of course it's bleeding. Um, pretty much it was just cl uh, uh, clean film, like our, our like uh, saran wrap. Um, but by the time I got home, it was already bleeding out of the saran wrap. So. Um, it's just it's just gonna air out. I'll clean it tomorrow with some dial and I'll put a little bit of aquaphor on it. Indubitably, my dear friend. But there was lots of sanitizing. It didn't it wasn't like, okay, you're done, get the fuck out of here. I just think you should do it. Oh, no problem, Tails. Oh heck! Ack! <laughs> chocolate, 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 chocolate. chocolate. <laughs> Red thirteen. Have you played the Son the Shadow the Hedgehog game on PS2? I think it was on other ones, but that game is cram. <laughs> it's not good. It's not good. There's a full passageway back here, cram. I did enjoy him in Sonic Adventure 2 <gasps> on the Dreamcast. It goes to the library car. Yeah. Yes, thank you. It was terrible. Listen, how can there be a secret passage from the library car to whatever car that was on a train? And train. how can there be an elevator on the train? <laughs> how can a train car be the size of this library? This is a very mm -hmm. two-story library. Mm -hmm. 
I don't believe it. I, I have not played the, the, the battle version. I don't know actually what the difference is. I did play Sonic Adventure 2 on the Dreamcast when it came out. We need to add that to our inventory. That Hidden was... Passage. I didn't even know Tim, but I was becoming a Sega boy when the Dreamcast came out. I was the biggest, yeah, biggest defender Sega. of the Dreamcast. The big chow band! <laughs> play us a little ditty there. They don't miss. Um, I would like to take this time to remind the audience that the style of music that is played in Star Wars, um, it is called jizz. Um, the, sorry, sorry, what? <laughs> the what cantina band, the style of music that they are playing in the cantina is known as jizz. It is spelled the same way, and that is canon. So, like, instead of jazz. It's jizz. Why? Because it has to be... It, like I said, that old joke, that old Twitter thing is like, every character has to be named like Gulp Shitto. Yeah. And they play jizz. God. I think we should check the, the trash bin tails. <laughs> also, I don't know uh, how many of you are Star Wars fans, and I also don't know how many of you were able to see it, but they had a week where... There was something in the trash. Uh, Return of the Jedi was in theaters again. And Hot honey. I saw that up in the region because I was visiting and they didn't have it down here. Fucking amazing. God, the original trilogy in theaters is something else. Yeah, but I wish they would like let us see the original original trilogy. I actually made that, yeah, I, I made that uh, point to somebody um, because the special editions, all that stuff is completely needless. And it I looks think it, bad. It looks bad. And that was the one that they showed in the theaters. Was yeah, the special well, that's edition. the only one you can find ever to watch. No, you can buy it. You can buy the original unaltered. On VHS. No, on All DVD. Right. And now Blu-ray. Blu-ray. Hmm. But that is new. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I... Return of the Jedi, it's not my favorite. It is my probably third favorite of the original trilogy in total movies. Um, I really like Empire. However... Anakin being changed at the end, where they changed, they put in um, yep. Hayden Christensen. That fucking sucks. Yep. And uh, when the the people were singing inside Jabba's palace, they put that 3D animated weirdo, long lipped going. Me 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 me. It's yep. so bad. <laughs> yep. Yeah, they just added up like, hey, let's just throw them uh, just a bunch of random crap into the. Grunar Malk, welcome to the chat. And yeah, so bad. Don't give George Lucas. <laughs> Fucking any more rope. I mean, he can't anymore. But God, yeah, that was so bad. Much. And just it was, think of how many toys we could sell. So the last time I saw them in theaters were when they came out. The special editions came out in theaters, like in the late '90s, like '97, '98. Um, oh yeah, it was before the 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 episode one, and that was like clearly a primer for like the CG that they were putting in the new movies, the new trilogy. Yeah, and it ages. So badly, really poorly. CG does not age well. Like you know what we need? We need a little scene with with Jabba the Hutt crawling around on the sand, like moving around, talking to Han. Like we need to just need to see him walking, oh my God. Just squirreling around a little when, bit. When they have the like in that movie where um, Han has to like he's moving, he's talking to Jabba, and that was before Jabba was like a gross monster. Right. He just like he steps on his tail and he goes boop boop boop. Like in the movie, it looks so bad. Like they just like yeah moved him out of the way. Yeah. Or like how they changed it to how Han didn't shoot first. Yeah, they, like, what is that? They digitally moved him out of the way. Why? Yeah. That's so stupid. Really, really stupid. Just, God. It is better if he shoots first. It makes more sense for him to shoot first. He's a scoundrel. That's, That's what makes him so cool. That's his whole deal. his whole deal. He's a scoundrel. It's just, it's just so bad. Uh, special edition's not good. Um, thumbs down. Uh, the only thing I I'm glad you can get the originals. Yes, like my dad still has them on VHS. Tangential. I just got. Oh yeah, dark mode on Twitch. That's all. I, is, if there's a dark mode available, I have it. Um, the the only thing I will say to the special editions, the only edition that is good, is they improved how to add lightsabers to it, so the lightsabers look better. That's all. That's all I'm giving them. They figured out the technology to make them look cool. Birthday law. We should have known. Ah, uh, birthday law. Birthday law. Did you know in the sky there is no law? In the sky there is no <laughs> law. <laughs> a 
Leave me be. Oh, sh Shadow, I really hope that they recognize your union. I do love how they get into like interrogation mode, just like a yeah, a fucking uh, Ace Attorney. Ace Attorney would be a great game. It's not like this at all. It is actually like a. I have to pay attention to what's going on. Time to reveal my hot tip. Gross. <laughs> Gross. Gross. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> the only door that leads to the conductor's car. So Shadow was locking all the doors for one reason and one reason alone to keep Sonic from escaping the conductor's car. Shadow's trapping Sonic. Oh, by the way, one good outcome from the dog situation, if you didn't hear that, was um, we met the person whose yard that we were able to leave a trap in. Um, we be, we're we becoming friends with that person now, and we're going to get a drink with them tomorrow. So, new friends, which is cool. Again, silver lining of a terrible situation. <laughs> I gotta get my thoughts in order. I gotta think. I gotta think about the rings. Did you notice the little? Um, this is probably something for idiots like me. Um, the little three circles in the bottom right corner are the same three colored circles or ovals, ellipses that uh, were on the Game Gear, the Sega Game Gear. That's right. It was like the Game Boy, but the I mean, eight I the Sonic faster. One for the Game Gear, and what? it was just really a different. little different. Yeah. It was like the same boss, but different. So, uh, this is something that no one cares about but me. Um, the Game Gear was basically, not basically, it was the Sega Master System that they shrunk down and put a screen into. It was the same hardware. So, a lot of games for the Sega Master System, which is this system that predated the Genesis, is basically just in your hands. That's, oh, excuse me. Also, why it <laughs> <laughs> absolutely, absolutely chewed through batteries. It was like six batteries at a time, and it lasted you maybe a couple hours. Now, on my Game Boy, four double A's lasted forever, forever. And, and more importantly, I could play Wario Land, and I could play Pokemon. And that really was the whole kit and caboodle. Cram! Cram! I played it so much. I was I was the target demographic. It was the right time. I traded Pokemon on the bus because I rode the bus until I could drive. Um, and it was just the perfect, like, yeah, we are, we are getting out the link cable. We are trading Pokemon. We are battling. We're on the playground. They couldn't have shot a commercial better. And the key ring validates that claim. This one. Think. Oh, think. God. I think. 60 this rings. Oh, my God. Cram's Dream Gear. Oh, it even says Dream Gear. Game Gear. See? You all see now. Huh? You all see. Huh? Boing. That one got me good. Oh, you're golden. Golden. <laughs> Two keys on me. I am surprised that a certain nervous hair person is not here. Yeah, or is nervous share. Yeah. Yeah. A little bit, a little bit weird, a little bit sus. As the kids said two years ago. Birthday present? Oh. I need to figure out something new to do with my hair. It's getting too long. Oh, I know what Shadow's gift to Amy was. It was the piece of evidence found in the garbage. The garbage? Shadow wanted to keep us away. Not us, Cram. Trying to keep Amy away while he printed out the tickets and bought her present. Uh. <laughs> what? Ah ha! <laughs> huh? I have a theory. Oh. 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 <laughs> so there's a in the uh, P90X3 challenge workout, which yeah. is push-ups, pull-ups. 
uh, there's a bit where he asks the the one girl. She's doing push-ups. She's like, what number are you on? She goes, nine. <laughs> and then he says, what are you trying to get to? 20. <laughs> so I'll watch that whole half-hour thing just for that moment. Oh. I um I do the – so my workout schedule is lift, run, lift, run, lift, run. And I do a sequence of yoga one day. And <laughs> press it. 20, 20. <laughs> Um, yeah. But the P90X3 yoga, which is a half hour long, I like P90X3 yoga, is what I do on my yoga days, so just to make sure I'm all stretched out. I, I like the the balance poses section yes. of that, because some of the um, strength poses I can't do, like the twisted triangle and stuff, like I'm just not flexible enough. I, I have gotten better over time. Those those are tough. I'm not I'm not a very flexible yeah, person. Yeah, I just end up like, oh, I'll just try a little bit, but the balance poses I'm actually good at. I have a, uh, I have a yoga block that is very helpful for those. Yeah. Um, but just something to like, it helps the shoulders. Like crow helps the shoulders. Um, just stretching out the hamstrings. Mine are super tight because I run so much. Um, just getting those like a little bit like loose so they don't just seize. Um, but yeah, P90X. I did P90X one, and that is a time sink. Uh, oh yeah, it's so long. It's so long, like just ninety minute workout. Which I mean, it's weird because it's like if I do I, when I go to the gym, I'm usually there for about ninety minutes. Yeah, an hour to ninety minutes. However, sitting in front of a video and being there for ninety minutes is super different. I mean, is there a place for, at the gym where you can put pop a video in? No. Right. So right. No. It's like do it at your house. Yeah. And it's just it's just such a long. I remember doing it once with people. Yeah, we did it a few times. Okay. Yeah, it was yeah. just so much time. And the, the P90X yoga, P90X one yoga, takes an hour and a half of straight yoga. And it's ridiculously hard. Like, um, yeah. if you are not, it's it's not just flexibility. It, it is that. But it's also strength. It's a lot of strength. Um, a lot of core work. A shit ton of core work. Um, which is great. I mean, these are all things that are good to do. Strengthening your core helps your back, which is what I tell people because it's true. If you have back pain, strengthen your core because it helps support your back. Um, it's just a lot of work. Like it's just so much time. I don't have that kind of time. The plan's fatal flaw. Oh, no. Something's buzzing. buzzing. The birthday key. We buzzing. We super buzzy. Probably not to anybody else though. No, just, not. just us. Ooh, that's better. For Essie Jane knows because she comes and works out with me. Yeah. Most Tuesdays, unless your unless basement's she your basement's pretty great for for working out. Four forty-five is saying I can't make it. <laughs> I try to hit the gym at times when it is not busy, which is usually the mornings or. I'll tell you what, the best possible gym time, it's my favorite time to go to every time. Mid-afternoon on a Sunday, nobody's there. nobody's there. It fucking rules. I can take my time. I can do, like, the Olympic platforms are all cleared. Um, I think, by the way, thanks to Red13 for showing me the ropes back when at the Corec. I had never lifted before, and he showed me proper forms. Uh, 4.40 a.m. traffic. <laughs> I would love another workout, buddy. I, I, I can't find one right now. Um, I did meet... Uh, I don't see him enough, but I met someone at the gym. He's like a union. He used to be part of the Teamsters. I think he just got a new job. But I'm trying to like... Hey, would, I mean, we can work out together. Like, that'd be cool. We could be friends. You said that? No, I was thinking that. But we did have a nice conversation because we were sharing a, a machine because it was just too packed. So we were just uh, working out, each of us. That's not a microphone. <laughs> Absolutely. Beatbox. <laughs> yes. That was impressive, Cram. Tails did. Also drive the train. 
Just like, just like running, chat, if you live near me and you know me in real life, in real person, if you wanna take up lifting and go lifting with me, not even, we don't even have to do the same things. I'm all game. I would love to have some lifting buddies. I would do it, but I can't make it always. Yeah. We have a friend who lives in Ohio now that used to be a lifting buddy of mine. Um, but she doesn't, uh, she doesn't live here anymore. But she would go to the co-rec and we'd just kind of hang out as I lifted. And it was great. Just having somebody to talk to. No, I hear you, Red 13. You're a little, uh, you're a little uh, swamped. I did feel bad. Like, uh, I'm not going to reveal whatever was going on with you and, and, and what's going on. It, but, like, when I was going through stuff, I felt like so, like, fuck. Like, you're dealing with so much. I feel so bad, like, uh, complaining about not humans. Cram, ugh. Total flub. Already clicked on this one. Oh my god. <laughs> what else is there? Is there like an arrow? I think I've clicked everything. Uh, oh my god. Wait, go around. You click the screwdriver. Ah, I missed that. Was someone playing oh, it's a dart. dart? That's a blow dart. <gasps> oh my god, someone a new dart? I love oh no, the conductor. It was his last train ride before he retired for uh, 35 years. No. And somebody, somebody st got him, him, him in the heart. Stake with the heart. The heart they got him they in, got the him in the, the, the <laughs> Is that from Homestar? Yeah. <laughs> there the was, vampire. So we played, uh, we had forced fun, fun time at work. And um, during that, they have a, you know, we played Gartic phone before. But they have, um, Discord has games built into it now, and Gartic Phone is one of them. So we played Gartic Phone, and there was someone who drew someone who looked just like the Poop Smith. So I was like typing like, oh, I met the Poop Smith, and the person was like, who, who's, who's the, the Poop Smith? Who's the Poop Smith? <laughs> <laughs> you know, he's he's by the pile of what's it? Why hasn't Sonic shown up? Because he's dead. Victor. What's your vector, Victor? Come with me to get Sonic. He wants to be pretending to be dead, lazy bum. Let me tell you, darlings. When did Knuckles start adorning himself with a cool hat? For this... Third I think he was worn that hat in other places. Oh, I don't know. I love escape rooms. Count me in. No, I... I yeah, no, he's definitely had it the whole, whole scenario. I want to feel like it exists outside ah! this game. What in, the world? what in the world? That's Amy's voice. Oh no, Sonic's dead again. He's not responding to us. Is he actually dead? Is, is he hurt? Why isn't he moving? moving? Sonic, can you hear us? He's banged up. You just hear him and he goes, that ch chili dogs. <laughs> chili dogs. I need, I need a chili dog. Sonic's dead. He's in no more games after this. <laughs> Tails is not having it. What did he meet his match with? Indigestion? This is your fault, Cram. This is all your fault, Cram? Oh, we, have to, oh, we have to name no. who killed... Arnar! <laughs> Who do we think killed Sonic? Chat, who do you think killed Sonic? Because I kind of, I gotta be honest. I don't know. I had no know. flipping idea. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's Amy. Really? I mean, I don't know. She seems very birthday adjacent. She does have a key to every room, but sometimes it's cool. Or Shadow. I don't think it's Shadow. It Shadow's too the obvious. obvious one. Tails. Could be Tails. Tails has been really weird the whole time. Tails! Neither Tails nor I can be the murderer. 
Oh yeah, that's right. Let me pick again. I think it's Amy. It can't be. Why? Because she just said neither tails or I can be the murderer. Yeah, but I still think it is. Yeah, but we gotta pick somebody else. <laughs> There's a right answer, and it won't let us pick anyone else. I actually appreciate that, so we don't have to play the whole fucking scenario again. Yeah. The horny one in the bottom left corner. <gasps> oh! But if it's about all the wits you wish. Okay! Oh, but he it was in the library car, and there's a secret passage. It is, it is so Ace Attorney. In Ace Attorney, you can fail. It doesn't seem like you can fail. We discovered a sacred passage to the lounge, which is right by the conductor's room. Secret passage. Cram, do you have an idea? Oh, did this be on the library in the train manual? He's a poet, so a quick reader. Ah! Excuse me. <gasps> he sped read a book. The uh, the the moral of the story is that don't don't read. Here's the thing about Tim and I and books. I really like reading books. Big fan of books. Tim is ridiculously fast at reading books. I do. I do like it to read a book. It is infuriating. <laughs> he can fly through a book. I'm sick and tired of Tim being too talented sick, at shit. Sick and tired of Tim. Yeah, I am done with it. Being able to read <laughs> books faster than I can. Well, you're always just listening to him. Well, yeah, I listen to him at two speed too. Two X. Oh, SBO. Who here knew? I do audiobooks because... Well, I do it when I'm, like, running and stuff. Um, when I'm doing other things. Chores, running, uh, working out. It's usually not... Like, I'm not, like, sitting here, like, on a, like... Like, sitting motionless listening to an audiobook. Who said they would show us something? <laughs> Flub. Show us something later. Try... Um, Blaze. That's this one? Yeah, that's that one. The purple cat. Bro. Oh, Bro has blueprints. <laughs> I will say, like, when I run for long distances, I will listen to an audiobook for a while. I'll get kind of bored, like you're saying. And then I'll switch to, like, music or I'll listen to a podcast. I usually switch between, like, all those three things multiple times when I'm running. SPO. Swipe them from the conductor. Like during, I've listened to one book full through on one marathon, but most of the time I'm switching between a lot of different things. A lot of times when it gets to the point where I'm like, fuck this, I'm just seeing red, I fucking hate this, just let it be over, um, I have a playlist of, of very upbeat music that I listen to. If I am Murdered Sonic, how did I do it? With a blow dart! A blow dart! You're close, Cram! What would Sonic do? He'd die. As many races as I've run, I will tell you, it does not, there's around mile 18, it does not get easier. It's still something that I want to kill myself for figuring, like, why did I sign up for this? It's still hard. I think it's hard to run by yourself. It is. It I, is. I just can't. One of the most fun runs I've done was the one that um, we did when we ran the half in Indy. That was really yep. fun because we, fun. Were, we were just, like, talking the whole time. Yep. No, runner's high's not fake. I, so... Of all of the, the races I've done, I have never feel like I've experienced runner's high. I, I don't necessarily agree with like the oh the euphoria or whatever, but I it's really fun to run a race. It is fun. But I mean, yeah, I guess like the high, like oh I feel high. I don't feel like I am dancing on cloud nine. Right. That is what people feel. I've never felt that. Oops. Oopsie pipsy. I will only run by myself. 
No, running by yourself really sucks. It's it's so much easier to run really far when you're with someone the whole time. There are times when like running is like my meditation, and it's time for me to like. There are times when I'm like, I just need to process some thoughts that I have going on, um, some things that are going on in my head, and I like running alone. Then, however, um, I I think long races are really fun for people. Like Tim and I were like playing music, we were talking to people. They were like also running. Like that was a lot of fun. It, it's a yeah. complete distraction from what's going on. Yep. It's fun. Boy, oh, I haven't run in a long time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm running two this year. I got Seattle and Minneapolis, and I got to get going on training. You deny the allegations. Why not that sound like the conductor's car? How was he found in the dining car? I'll say this, right, 13? There is, when I'm running, and this is truly true, of almost everybody that I've run with, nobody cares what speed you're going at. Nobody cares. Like, there's nobody, there's no, like, judgment there. Um, people who are, like, elites who run races, like, they're so far ahead of everybody. Oh, they're not even a consideration. It's just about having fun and, and being cool. Being cool. What's about having fun and being cool? Just running. Like in I'm general. Sorry, I'm trying to solve no, no, no. this crime. No, I'm just saying like in general, like if you're concerned that people are like, oh, this person's too slow or they're Oh yeah, they're, nobody, no, cares. nobody cares. It's like going to the gym and feeling self like I get why you people feel self conscious, but almost everybody who are really there at the gym to like do stuff, they're there to they're just focused on their own workout. They yeah. they're not paying any attention to anybody else. I know I'm not. People just want to get some. <laughs> hey, I'm not telling you you should change anything what you're saying. Like you, you do what you feel comfortable doing. Obviously, uh, run, don't run. That, that's all your choice. Just reinforcing that, like if you choose to, uh, there's not people who are like, oh, this person's so slow. Look at them go, or not go. They're just. Oh. I'm, whenever I run, I, I will run whatever speed at the person that I'm at. I'm just excited that someone wants to do this this thing that nobody likes to do with me. The vent. Oh, some kind of long attic, hidden path straight to the dining car. And, the vent. And if I want to run more, I'll, I'll I'll just run more when we're done. That's that's, that's it. You're a smart kid. Cause you broke the robot arm. Robot arm. Room. You can do this, cram. <laughs> well, you have to understand too. Um, a lot of us, and at the time, Tim too. Like we've been running for a while, so like you develop that just by doing it a lot. Um, develop what? Like lung capacity and like, oh yeah, and yeah, stuff. yeah. yeah. It goes away so, it's so fast. So fast. So fast. Um, I, I, you know, again, I'm not telling anybody to run a marathon or, or whatever. It's like when I started running, I could barely run three miles. Um, there was no, it, it just took a lot of like, you just do it a lot. Uh, and that's something if you like doing it. There's no yeah, like when we ran together, we just did like a, a 5K. Uh, um, and yeah, we were talking the whole time, but you hadn't been running at all. Right. I mean, we've been running five miles a day for a like few in the mornings. mornings. Yeah. And uh, I remember the first time I hit five miles together, and I kept having to stop. Like after mile three, I kept having to stop and walk or whatever. But it was like it sucked. Uh, but then eventually, like we would run. Yeah. Then we hit ten or eleven. We went to the airport and back for N10 USA Airport. Um, and then, uh, then I was like, okay, I'll do the half because I was like, if I can do eleven, I can do two more. I still I'm missing all the rooms. Yeah, I still maintain that. Like, um, so I ran uh, Madison last year, and like, it was 15 degrees. Oh. Um, it got so cold so fast. It was like a, a cold snap there. Um, not that Madison is particularly warm, but it was like really cold, and I was barely prepared for it. That and the uh, circular marathon that we ran, 
were the two worst fucking races. Circular Logic was so bad because it was so cold. And that wasn't even temperature cold. It was just no, really? wind chill. It was so bad. It, it was like, so it was, um, it was a, a full marathon that we could distribute the miles however we see fit. And the, there's no um, cap or, or like minimum on team. So... We were Team Fleek on Fleek. <laughs> yeah, Team Fleek on Fleek. That, that should date uh, when this happened. <laughs> um, and it was, uh, we just, it was just us, Tim and I, and we were, so between us, we were running a half. Uh, fuck, that's hard. I just have to not get hit ever. And we had to, like, dude, so every Our, like, track mile, get around the lap 25 times. Yeah, so every mile we switched We off. switched every three miles. It was three miles. That was a mistake. So, but I don't even know a better way to do it. Um, I think every mile would have been better. So it would be less time standing around. Every time that we, like, would get warm because it was so cold, we'd stop, trade off a little bracelet, whatever, and ankle we'd stand around for half an hour. Stand around, get so fucking cold, and then, like, start it up again. So I was, like, waiting, like, fucking miles. So I need to get warm again. Yeah, my joints completely, like, seized up. But the last, the last lap I did because it was, you know, it's an odd number. Uh, I did the last mile and I could barely move. It hurt so bad. Luckily, uh, I ran into somebody that I knew from work. He was doing a, a lap too. Oh and yeah, so I know that. Person. I just had to like fake it and run with him around <laughs> and like just talk and ignore the horrible pain in my knees. And uh, then I couldn't run for like six months because my knee would explode every time I tried. That was such a... That's what made me stop running that race. That was such a cool race. Oh, come on! Yes! Got it. Yeah, it was really rough. And that, that's why, because I couldn't run. And then when I tried to again after like six months when I finally could, I just didn't have the stamina for it. And then I had kids and didn't have time for it. Or I had more kids. And now I'm in my 30s and tired all the time. Yeah, well, yeah. Um, Red 13, uh, I, I know totally you don't have to do anything again. I'm just putting it out there. Every year between marathons, because they usually happen in October and November, to stay sharp, I do the Purdue half in October. It's a really, they, they change the course. It's really nice. Um, uh, if you're interested in ever doing that, anybody actually in the chat, do the Purdue Mid Half. It's pretty fun. I'm willing to do whatever speed you want at any time. I'm not, you know, I'm not interested in breaking any times. It's just to keep keep myself in the game uh, for the next race. Um, it's a good, it's a good, cheap, uh, nearby, and also free beer at the end. Half. Which which half? The Purdue Half. You start at. Uh, Rossade, and you end at Rossade. Please. It was you, It was you, SPO. You were the one who murdered Sonic. He's, He's alive! Back. Right. Ooh. Ooh he SPO jumped me in the, me in the conductor car. Well, he actually, like, blow darted him. <laughs> There's something important. Everyone, listen. The train's a bad nick? That's why there's oh, like a robotnik, robotnik stuff badnik? everywhere. Are you feeling all right? We all need to get off this train. We're not safe. Conductor was on. Right. Oh, the conductor is definitely Dr. Robotnik. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. A Flicky. Dr. Eggman. Remember Flicky's from the game... Sonic 3D Blast, which we played on this channel. Check out our YouTube channel. We have all the episodes that we <laughs> record here on that. So we have years of content. The train is his co-conductor. Thank you, thank you. YouTube.com slash Tim and I play. Do, ba, do, do, boop, ba, do, do, do. Doo doo. Ooh. It took the conductor. I knew something was wrong. Oh, but he did. Doo doo. 
I was surprised I could do any at this point. Spin dash. Doo doo. When does this whole thing get sexy? Doo 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 doo. -doo, -doo. Look, it's like a face. It is like a face. Oh no. Oh no! I murdered Sonic the it's Hedgehog. Sexy now. <laughs> <laughs> we already knew that, SBO. Are you crazy? Doo doo. Doo doo. Use this blow dart on Sonic. Stationed in the conductor car. See? Use blow dart. Bam. Doo doo. Ah, intrigue. Oh my gosh. Doo doo. Who instructed? Oh, I think I have an idea. The conduct. Oh. I think it was the conduct. Mm. Yeah, well, well, I was just. I just thought it was. I just thought it was a cool twist if it. Mm. <laughs> doo doo. Yeah, probably. Birthday law. Red 13. Birthday law. Yeah, when it's your birthday, you can do pretty much whatever you want. It's my birthday! Doo doo. Oh, oh yeah. No, See, it's he's got a, eyes. Real, it's a face. Dr. Rotrain. The man. conductor! I was one day from retirement! Don't touch him. Of course, I can talk to you folks. We'll get it figured out. I'm taking a little bit of Eggman's uh, base! Ha. Where you will rot. Right to his egg fortress. Annoying! Can I offer you an egg in this troubling time? <laughs> the conductor and I will be free to laugh and play games. Ride the open rails. Oh, he loves the conductor. Enough! Have at you! Which one of these buttons turns the train off? Whoa! Hey, anybody got any chili dogs? He's like sick to his stomach. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh no. A bunch of oh, evidence is <laughs> falling out of my pocket. My evidence! Oh, I thought this game was over. <laughs> Me too. Might be a good time to... Twist, I know. Pause. Yeah, as soon as we can save. Oh, well, I can't, I can't save right now, can't I? Alright, okay. No need to yell, bud. Hanging in there. <laughs> Great question, but how are you? Sonic, ask it about me. I'm, I'm doing, doing amazing. amazing. <laughs> Lead the way. All right, let's see. Save. 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 Yeah. Well, everybody, it's been a fun week back. Yep. Uh, we are guests going to finish this game next week uh, because, dang. Um, thanks oh, no. I accidentally clicked. No one look. Spoilers. Spoilers. Oh, it's, it's, an it, Eggman. it's Eggman. It's Eggman. It's an Eggman. E Bye, everyone. Later. See you next time on the next time. See you next time on the next on time. On the next time. Fart.